You say to me, oh, but Joy, there's nothing original underneath the sun. You are absolutely right in saying that, but. Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl Joy from Be The Difference Clothing. Yes, we're back again with another amazing video and talk that will not only inspire you, but challenge you to be a better person, better version of yourself. Please, please, please like, subscribe, and share. Thumbs up the video. Make sure you are putting these practical ideas into practice, or at least thinking about it. What's the harm that can be done? All we're trying to do is be the difference. <laughs> also guys, if you have a topic that you would like me to discuss, please put the comments down below. We'll get those topics talked about and you know, it's a great learning process for me too. Authenticity, how you become more authentic in your own life. First things first, don't copy because in all actuality, you can copy as much as you want, but it's the same thing as a habitual liar. Once they are caught in their lie, there's a web of unweaving that needs to be done. And once that is unweaved, you become nothing but a shell and no one will take you seriously. Or at least it might take some time, a couple years for that authenticity to be rebuilt because now you have to figure out who you are, whom you are and what you are to become. So you might as well be authentic from the beginning. <laughs> Here's the other thing. I feel like it's very important that we give and pay homage to whomever the author is. How would you feel if you created something and then someone comes along who is a little bit more strong, a little bit more notable, nor more savvy in how to get things out to the mass and takes your information and gives it to them first. Now, when you finally get to the masses, your information seems like it's the copycat. Who wants to be the author, but can't be the author because you're considered the copycat. Now you ask me, does it matter? Yes, it does. This is why it matters because every time you are taken for granted or your authenticity is taken from you, the world becomes more confused. It's like we're growing in more confusion because we don't know who the originator is. We believe anything. And then once the copycat, the true copycat can't deliver, now you're looked at, are you genuine? Is your information viable? So yes, guys, do your best to develop your own persona. Do your best to be able to authenticate your own self. Do your best to be okay with who you are and love who you are. Be determined to be the best version of yourself. I remember a long time ago now, we were on Hello World and we were talking about authenticity. When you are authentic, you take pride in yourself. When you're not authentic and you just take someone else's authenticity, you deliberately don't handle it with care. Not that just not to say that you don't care, but because you didn't spend the sweat, tears, or the time to come up with the idea, how can you hold it as near and dear as the originator? You may be wondering like, why are we talking about authenticity? Why is this so important? It's important because it builds character. And if you start building a character that is not your own, you're going to be lost in the sauce. You're going to be more traumatized in your own trauma. You're going to be more confused about life. You're going to be going further away from your purpose. Worst case scenario, you're going to be diving deeper and deeper and deeper into the abyss of depression because you are not being whom you are supposed to be. If the shoe does not fit, it becomes very uncomfortable. Even if it's a little bit too big or a little too small, it becomes too much. The pressure of it all, the fit of your foot and the design of your foot starts to change just to fit. Then not only does the foot change, but also the stature. 
The structure of your bones change. It is that deep. So if you are not completely okay with being whom you are and who you are, I challenge you. I challenge you to take the steps to become authentic. You say to me, oh, but Joy, there's nothing original under, underneath the sun. You are absolutely right in saying that. But honestly, when it becomes the authenticity of an individual, you are mapped out a little different so that it does not match completely. Because you are to reach certain people. And in that reaching of certain people, you have to become a certain way. And if you don't model your certain way as to the authentic part of who you are, you will become something and further away from producing whatever it is that you needed to produce to help whomever it is that you're supposed to help. And then your pathway becomes strained. Not only does the help of other people fall short, your help along the way becomes further and it also falls short. So now do you see how important it is for you to be authentic in your own self? If you've made it this far in a video, like, subscribe, and share. Look below because there's a surprise for you for staying this long and I appreciate you. If you have any topics that you would like to discuss, put them in the comments below and we will talk about them. Let not your circumstances make you feel obligated to no longer become the authenticator of your life. Your light and how it shines depends on you and how authentic you truly want to be. If you like this top, or this book and want to know more about it, go to be the difference LLC.com. Let's flip through and see what quote we come up with today. The simplest thing you may say to someone can alter their life for better or worse. Choose your words wisely. The simplest thing you may say to someone can alter their life for better or worse. Choose your words wisely. How fitting. Become the authentic version of yourself. Do not be afraid. What's more better than living a life in your purpose, being authentic, and not having to pretend to be someone and something you are not. With that being said, guys, my name is Joy from Be The Difference Clothing. May your light and your life become more W-H-O-L-E and sweeter as the day goes by. I'll see you soon.